Right, I've started soldering some of these pipes up, but I've made a mistake where the pipe goes through the joist. The pipe's actually touching. And then uh, you don't want that because when it heats up and uh, cools down, it'll end up with noises like this. So I'll we'll have to redo that one. I haven't been able to do a video the last couple of days because uh, my camera wasn't working properly. But uh, we'll try and get some footage for you today. Also on this pipe, I've done the join here. It's not quite straight. I don't know if you can't really see, but I'm gonna have to redo that because I need it as straight as possible. to the cold water which is coming off the rising main so that'll feed the water into the boiler goes off to the boiler heats it up for your central heating and your hot taps so this pipe just here is actually going downstairs into the bathroom hot tap the kitchen hot tap which is further that way uh, and also there's another bathroom hot tap so we're downstairs now the plan is to come down into this corner we can come down with the two 15mm pipes, come across here for this radiator, but also we can drill through and pick up another radiator on the other side. This is the other side of the wall in the other bedroom. You can get uh, two holes in here, come across and then up on each side for a radiator underneath that window. That's all for this. I'm just going to hold the clip up to the ceiling, try and get some light pencil and then we can mark that up a little line next to the clip move it over to mark the next one get your drill So this is the bedroom I've just come out from and it's over in this corner. Okay, so there's the holes. And you can see, you can't really see but I can see uh, straight down into the bedroom. So now these pipes, this one can go straight down and this one will have to come across in a 90 degree angle and then down. So two reducers, a little bit of pipe, one, two, three 90 degree 15mm bends.